precipitation goes, but there's more on the way. Yeah, a lot more. We got a rain tonight, more rain late tomorrow night, okay. and as a result, we got a flood watch in effect. We got some fog out there as well, not in Newport, but uh, in North Situate. We got a snow eater going on here. You're going to be noticing all the snow disappearing over the next 24, 48 hours. Here's Newport. We've got cloudy skies, not seeing as much fog here. You can see the precipitation from this morning continuing to work its way out of here. The snow, freezing rain, little bit of sleet, plain old rain, still some lingering showers and a lot of drizzle out there this uh, afternoon, but not an overly uh, impactful kind of a weather situation today. It's not very uh, pleasant to look at tonight. Uh, fairly quiet. We will have more rain move in, but as we get another batch of rain in here late Thursday night and into Saturday, uh, we are looking at an impact in the form of some flooding. In fact, we have a flood watch in effect for that time frame Thursday and into Saturday. We'll go over the timeline in a second. Temperatures are in the 30s, 34 in Providence, 34 in Smithfield, just over the freezing mark in Glendale and Coventry, 37 in Newport and over in New Bedford, 36. So we've We've got this one little batch of showers still working through the rain off to our west is currently out in Pennsylvania, down into Ohio, and all the way down into the deep south. It's going to come in a couple of pieces. Here's the first one that'll come on through during the nighttime tonight. The second one way down here eventually works its way around the bend and gets into southern New England late tomorrow night. So let's time it out. Hour by hour forecast this afternoon. Couple of rain showers, a lot of drizzle, areas of fog, just generally kind of soupy. As we get into the evening, maybe right after the evening commute or maybe even during the commute we will begin to see some widespread rain working in. This is midnight tonight. A lot of rain around. It continues into tomorrow morning. This is 7 a.m. And notice we're dealing with plain rain here. Temperatures are actually going up overnight into the 40s. We'll see that rain push offshore. Some lingering showers perhaps along the south coast during the day tomorrow, but most of the area will likely end up dry. As we go into the nighttime tomorrow night, especially late in the night, another round of rain and that will impact the Friday morning commute, maybe a little heavy in spots. It's out of here, I think, by noontime, and then we begin to dry out Friday afternoon. Saturday looks like it'll be dry, but all the impacts from all that rain and the snow melt will be felt in the rivers. There'll be some street flooding, poor drainage flooding, especially Thursday night and into Friday and the river flooding possibly into Saturday. Rainfall forecast expecting three quarters of an inch. Some spots may be as high as an inch and a half. We'll have to watch that. And because of all that rain and the snow melt, Here's that flood watch street, poor drainage flooding, river flooding for only Rhode Island, not southeastern Mass, uh, Block Island not included. Uh, that could change. It may work its way into southeastern Mass, that flood watch. So stay tuned for today. Some drizzle, some fog, few rain showers, temperatures upper 30s to around 40 degrees for tonight. Rain likely through the evening and overnight and into tomorrow morning with the temperatures going up in the 30s this evening, going up into the 40s through the night. Here's your seven day forecast. Forecast. So we've got the uh, rain tomorrow morning, especially a little bit of light rain through the daytime tomorrow. Another batch of rain arrives late tomorrow night into Friday morning. There's that break Friday afternoon and into Saturday, but then more rain on Sunday and that will likely turn over into some snow late on uh, Sunday and into early Monday. How much there with the snow? It's way too early. We're just dealing with a few batches of rain to come through. <laughs> right. One thing at a time. All right. Thanks, TJ. Coming up tonight on 12 News Start.